Здравствуйте, дорогие зрители, это я, космонавт, подкатил вам новый видосик. <laughs> hey guys, I don't know what I'm doing with these intros anymore, I wanted to do something different. I figured let's whip out some Russian, but hope everybody's doing well today. Today I'm going to be doing something that I have wanted to do for a very long time. Now obviously everybody has read the thumbnail, everybody has looked at the title, read the thumbnail, looked at the title. Yeah, that makes total sense. Uh, and you know that I'm going to be taking my original survival truck. This is the first vehicle that I ever built in survival. I mean, it started off as something, you know, jankier. But this was basically, you know, my first truck that got me around this whole world. Uh, it does have the party wheel of doom. It just keeps spinning forever and forever. It's the uh, perpetual party machine. But uh, today it's gonna, it's gonna get demolished. <laughs> I do have a video of this thing spinning around. And well, I guess I have more of that footage now as well. But I uh, definitely wanted to, you know, keep the memory of the spinning wheel alive. I don't know why, but this thing just spins by itself. Always. Constantly. I I don't touch it. I haven't done anything to it. It just does that by itself. We're going to be taking the wheels off this thing, guys. We're going to be putting some thrusters on it and hopefully making it fly. I don't know how that's going to work. I'll be fully honest. I have no clue how that's going to work, uh, but I have some ideas and hopefully, hopefully they work out. We're definitely going to have to rebuild this front end out of... Uh, something lighter and not steel but that's okay we're gonna keep the shape that's all that matters okay guys well let's uh let's get this thing to the build platform sorry wheel oh there we go sorry wheel and get it lined up because it is going to be nighttime again soon it's scrap mechanic it's always nighttime we're gonna just get this set up over here and that way we have some light when we're working on it now as you guys can see i've got some thrusters here i've got controllers i've got buttons I've got suspension. Uh, we should be good. I mean, there's a lot of things to do on this right now. We have to rebuild it out of wood. I have to take the wheels off. I have to mount up the thrusters in such a way that I can control them. Uh, I have to install fuel tanks. I have to install suspension glitches. There's a lot to do. And hopefully I can actually fit it all on this one little truck. Maybe we'll have to extend the wheelbase a bit, but you know what? That's not a big deal. We'll uh, we'll see what we get up to. So let's get going. First things first, I'm just going to take off the suspension and the wheels because obviously we're not going to need that and we'll go from there. Alrighty, there we go. Bare shell. This feels like car mechanic simulator. I, uh, I just put out a car mechanic simulator video before this one and it feels a lot like I'm playing car mechanic simulator right now, but that's... That's cool. I like it. <laughs> okay, so let's start taking off more of this metal stuff and I guess replace it with wood. Alrighty guys, so the truck is, I guess, mostly stripped of all its metal. I did leave some pieces on just for aesthetics. Uh, we're gonna have to do weight balancing anyway, so I figured I would leave it as is and start working on the actual, you know, thrusters. Uh, I am going to turn the lights on because it is quite dark now. Where is my light switch? Boom. <laughs> Beautiful. Much better this way and we can actually build at night now. Alrighty guys, so I think I might have worked something out here. So as you can see here, I've got my thruster on an angle. I've got two 
angles of rotation here, sorry, two degrees of rotation here. If I pull out my tool here, you can see there's a bearing there that flares the uh, thruster outwards, and there's another bearing there that flares it frontwards or backwards. Uh, the idea is to distribute the force of the thrusters in such a way that it makes it difficult for it to, you know, flip, makes it more stable, essentially. I want the thrusters flaring outwards, uh, that way I I feel like I would be more stable, uh, just, you know, just by, you know, knowing what I know about, uh, I guess, physics. <laughs> but uh, I think this is the way to go for now, at least. I'm going to try that out. Now, as you can see, if I get into my seat here, which is uh, facing the opposite direction, I can actually adjust that angle right there, which is perfect. That is exactly what I want. So we are going to be uh, giving this guy a go. I'm going to replicate the system on all four corners and then we'll go from there. Alrighty guys, so I <laughs> I actually went a little bit ahead and did some more stuff because I wanted to make sure that I can actually fit my fuel tanks and some other stuff. So as you can see, I've got two fuel tanks in the back. Uh, they're going to be powering two thrusters each. Should have enough fuel to hopefully uh, fly around like that for a decent amount of time. And obviously I've got a chest up front here which I will be able to store fuel in like so. Done. Uh, so now what I have to do is finish hooking up my thrusters to the controllers. And we're gonna give this a go, guys. I'm a little scared. I know we still need to do the suspension glitch and whatnot, I know. But I want to make sure that this thing can even, like, you know, have a chance of flying. So let's hook it all up. Now what I'm doing here with the controllers is I'm setting the initial angles to 45. And then I am setting the incremental to 2 angles, uh, 2 degrees, sorry, not 2 angles. Uh, setting it on loop, making it fast, and this way I'll be able to adjust uh, my, uh, my altitude, hopefully this way. But uh, now to make sure that they're all pointed in the right directions. <laughs> Slowly watching this thing take shape. <laughs> Alrighty, perfect. This thing looks like it's uh, mostly settled down now. I guess I need to hook up the thrusters. I gotta put some fuel in it and I have to try lifting off. Fuel, where's my truck? Where's my truck? I feel like I stole all my fuel for something. Nope, fuel's still here. Oh look, it's nighttime again. Lovely. Alrighty guys, it's all hooked up. I'm going to start with the lowest possible thrust just to see because I'm pretty sure this thing is going to be unbalanced. I'm pretty sure it's going to be unbalanced. So we're going to have to uh, do a bit more work just to get it uh, flying good. But let's let's get the thrusters turned on here. Okay, thrusters turned on the lowest. And now if we lower them down, does anything happen? I feel like we can raise the thruster power just a little bit more, you know? Okay, so I feel like more thruster power is definitely required. Let's bring it all back down again. Because if we raise the thruster power and it shoots up, that'll be bad. <laughs> oh, I really got to put that on uh, like a dead man switch, you know? This has got to lift it up, man. Nothing. One more level? Why not? I don't see why not. In fact, I see exactly why we should. Because <laughs> it's not lifting up at all. Okay, we're lifting. We're actually floating now. Perfect. And we're very back heavy. We're extremely back heavy. Man, I should have kept the front end metal, guys. I should have kept the front end metal. Okay, I'm going to bump up the power again because I think that's going to be optimal. And what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to rebuild the front end back out of metal. Seems silly to do it, but you know what? Let's let's get her done. If that's what has to happen, then that's what has to happen. Actually, I wonder if it has to be out of concrete. You know what? Let's just build out of concrete. Because metal isn't that heavy. And I feel like we might need more, like more weight overall. 
I'm leaving this base here because we need headlights. Let's build headlights again. I stole the headlights for something else. Okay, we got that good. Perfect. Okay, uh, I have more weight up front. Let's give this a go. Now, I suppose I should also build my suspension glitch now because that will determine uh, my weight distribution as well. So, yeah. Oh, I need a thruster on the back. Unless I can just use tilt. We'll have to see. I might have to add a thruster on the back. Which sucks because my whole creation is uh, wide, I believe. Sorry, three wide. Odd width. That's what I'm trying to say. My goodness. English. Okay, let's give this a go. Are we actually going forward now? Okay, perfect. We're actually tipping forward now. Alrighty, so we can remove some weight from there. This is going to be a bit of a weight balance uh, game, guys. I'm going to get it balanced out. And I'll recoup with you when it's all good to go. So the weight is actually not bad now, guys. Uh, it is a little wonky side to side, but I'm going to, I guess, balance that out later. So now I have to build some suspension glitches on this thing. And honestly, I'm not sure where to do it. I guess I'll have to do it all the way underneath here and maybe like somewhere in the back. Oh, random blocks. Uh, but yeah, now is the time to give it some yaw, uh, give it some pitch, and I guess give it some roll. So that's going to be fun. Um, without further ado, cue another time lapse. <laughs> Basically, what I'm going to try and do is fit the steering suspension underneath here. And then as far as the other ones go, well, we'll have to figure that out because there's not a lot of room. <laughs> I might have to extend the bed. Maybe I'll extend the bed or something. Well, I somehow ran out of food to eat, so I'm officially dying. And yeah, <laughs> I did grow some stuff, so we should be okay in a bit. But for now, I'm just going to have to uh, die and respawn with lower health. It is what it is. This is what happens when you don't plan ahead, guys. I ran out of beats. I ran out of beats. Alrighty, so while we're waiting for the raid, I guess I'm going to build these suspension glitches. I'm very worried. I'm worried I'm not going to be able to fit these very well. But we're going to give it a go anyway, because that's what we're here for. To give it our best shot. Also, I didn't realize that this is still made out of the crappy wood, but I think it kind of leaves the old, uh, you know, scrap truck charm to it. So we're just going to leave it. <laughs> That's basically my excuse for not wanting to rebuild this whole thing. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see if we have steering now, side to side. Nice, it's reversed, but it's working. Let's see if we can... Yes, this will be perfect. Okay, good, 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 good. We really have too much weight on the one side for some reason, it seems. And we're starving again. Hopefully this, uh... Wait, where's my raid timer? And yes, I did steal all my controllers from my mining machine because that needs to get rebuilt. And obviously the thrusters came from my catapult. So, kind of works out. I was sort of planning this all along to begin with. And, uh, yeah, just kind of works out. Okay, so I made a bit of a mistake. Um, these suspension glitches in the back here actually need to be on double bearings. So that is exactly what I'm going to do now, and uh, hopefully that works. Oh boy, it's raid time in one minute. <laughs> Gotta go. <laughs> and three. Wait, what? They came a little early. <laughs> well, fine by me. All right, is that it? That wasn't so bad. Perfect. All right, back to it. Ah, uh, so nice to have a well-lit area. So what I'm doing here, guys, I'm actually trying to uh, test my own skills and learn uh, how these suspension glitches work. So I'm wondering if I can get away with just, I guess, a four tall block. Uh, I might have to do five, but hopefully I can just get away with four. And that way I don't have to add any extra protrusions on my, uh, on my vehicle here. So let's give this a go. Just a quick little test. Okay, so this works. Perfect. This does exactly what I needed to do. 
lovely. My concern was that when you have a situation like this and you place a block onto the suspension piece here, it doesn't get attached to the bearing, but apparently it does. So the more you know, uh, I certainly didn't know that. Well, maybe I did, but I just forgot it. But it's good to uh, it's good to get that tested out before we get further into the build here. That tells me that this setup that I have here is good to go. And I just need to finish putting on some wood. And now this guy right here actually needs a bearing. Oh boy, relax. Rela re relax. Relax. <laughs> actually needs a bearing right there. And we are just going to slap that back on. Okay, technically we are good, guys. Technically we are good. I am going to place my controllers onto this thing. And we're going to hook it all up. And I guess let's put the lights on finally. I mean, geez. Also, I need to make more switches. I need to make a bunch more switches. There we go. Problem solved. Buttons are going to go in the center console here. Perfect. And we're going to have another switch for lights. As soon as that comes out. There we go. Lights in the back. It's the least critical switch. So, you know, perfect. And now we can turn our lights on and off. Thank goodness. <laughs> okay. Uh, now it's time to put some controllers in the back. Just like that. We're going to have some uh, cool looking tail lights. Oh man, unauthorized farming again. Actually, let's go check. Do I have any fertilizer? Let's go check on that stuff. Because I am hungry. I'm actually starving in real life too. But I was like, you know what? I want to record this episode right now. Because I've been wanting to build this flyer for a while. It's been in my mind. It's time to cross this idea off. And uh, here we are. Hopefully it actually flies. I have a feeling it's just going to fly awfully. I feel like the way that Khan and I did our gyrocopter makes way more sense to redistribute the thrust. But you know what? One can only hope. Unfortunately, we're gonna have a raid, but that's okay. We have beats now. We have the beats. And guys, don't worry. I am going to be working on my boathouse there. As you can see, I've got some stuff on top of it. It's a big hush-hush project right now, but I do have some ideas for it. Fant, I see you, dog. I uh, may, be, may be utilizing your mods as well, so we'll see. <laughs> Alrighty, let's hook all this stuff up. So everything is hooked up, and I think everything is in the right direction. I made sure to test that before uh, before embarrassing myself like I usually do. Uh, but I think now we're ready for our first kind of uh, flight slash takeoff slash... I don't even know. Hopefully, oh, hopefully nothing bad. Hopefully nothing bad. But I'm ready, guys. I'm ready. I'm ready to give this a go. Uh, we should probably maybe fill up with some fuel just in case. You never know. I'm gonna have to figure out some kind of landing gear for this thing because I think sitting on the ground like it is with the thrusters is actually lagging the game out a little bit. But, uh, or maybe it's my truck again. Who knows? Oh, uh, yeah, it was my truck. What do you know? <laughs> it's always the truck. All right, let's get into this thing and let's give it a go. Okay. Okay, we're, we're controlling it. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. it's so twitchy, though. It's so twitchy, but it's working, guys. Oh my goodness, it's actually working. Strict follow cam, there we go. There we go, strict follow cam. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Can we get back to base is the question. Can we get back to base is the question. Okay, flyer, come on, don't, don't, no, 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 no. It wants to go towards the driver's side, so I think we're gonna have to possibly figure something out for that. Okay, can we land? Can we land? Maybe the thruster power needs to be a little bit lower. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Nope, 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 nope. Up, 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 up. <laughs> up, 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 up. <laughs> okay, we're back home. <laughs> Guys, this thing works. It actually works. It's a bit of a doozy to fly, you know, but it works. I am going to try and put a little bit more weight maybe on the, dry on, on the passenger side. So let me get some concrete unless I already have some in my inventory. Sure do. And maybe we'll slap some blocks on, like, uh, like here or something, you know, like that. It's actually not a crazy difference, so maybe I'm only going to put, like, two, two blocks there. Let's give that a try. Oh, man, this thing looks so mean. I love it. I gotta paint it up still, but getting ready for takeoff. Careful. Careful. Yes. Nice. Look at that. Hover truck, baby. Okay. Now, which way does it want to tilt? I think it still wants to tilt towards the driver's side. Okay, careful. My steering isn't... Okay, my steering is working. No, my steering is not working very well. Interesting. 
Why is it not going in the one direction? Oh, that's all attached there. I messed it up. Land. Land. I knew something was wonky. <laughs> let's, uh, let's fix that up. Okay. Okay, we're up. We're up. We're turning. Nice. Guys, I love this thing. This is so cool. <laughs> I really love that my whole uh, idea with the pivoting of thrusters worked out as well. So let's see if we can get some forward flight here. Perfect. Oh boy. Okay, 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 okay. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Careful. Careful. Oh boy, what's with all the lag? Is it my truck again? Is my truck freaking out again? It's gotta be the truck, dude. It's always the truck. It's always the truck. I'm just gonna weld this thing up. It's, uh, it's getting out of hand. All right, back into this thing. Go fly around more. How's the fuel consumption? Pretty bad, but I mean, I am kind of messing around a lot. And the thrusters are level five. Yeah, they are. Okay, perfect. Alrighty, off we go again. Let's see if we can fly to the island uh, that's like where the monorail goes. That would be cool. And then land on top of the building or something. Come on. Up, 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 up. Nope, 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 nope. Not into the tree. Not into the tree. It does some weird stuff. I don't know why it's doing that stuff yet, but it does some weird stuff. Like it lists. Why does it list? Maybe it lists because the thrust isn't being redistributed like with uh, mine and... Khan's gyrocopter there. Oh boy. Okay, okay, okay. Nope. Let's get into a hover. Can you get into a hover? Can you get into a hover? At least my controllers are all level five and this thing is actually like, see, it gets into a, it gets into a spin. I don't like that. Oh boy. Here we go again. <laughs> Man, it would be so cool if Scrap Mechanic had like stabilization modules. I'm sure there's a mod for it. That'd be really cool. Maybe I'll just start playing modded Scrap Mechanic, you know? I do like playing vanilla because it's nice to see what you can get done with just, you know, vanilla components and play the game as it's meant to be played. But at the same time, it might be cool to build some uh, some stuff that you otherwise wouldn't be able to. All right, how are we doing here? Oh, boy. Yeah, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. Cool. I'm on top of a building. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let's jump down with this thing. If I hopefully I don't get knocked out. There we go. Anything up here? Probably not. So this thing definitely needs a bit of work, guys. It definitely needs a bit of work. If you guys have any suggestions in the comments below, please let me know. I am open to all suggestions. Um, if you have any ideas as to why my creation is a little bit unstable, just, uh, you know, throw it down in the comments. I would be, I would be elated to read your solutions and, you know, figure out why that's happening. But I'm going to paint this thing and I guess we're going to call it an episode. But first, we gotta fly back. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Oh jeez, I lived. I lived to tell the tale. Alrighty guys, here it is. I've lately been loving the white and purple combos, so I went with like a white, purple, grayish combo on this one. Really excited about it. I uh, also stole some uh, trailer lights to throw in the back there just to spice it up a little bit. Let me know what you guys think. Did I do my original truck justice? I thought it would be really cool just because like it's what I started with and I never destroyed it. I just kind of let it sit because this is what I wanted to do with it eventually. Now I am seeing my, uh, you know, my thrusters glitch into my wheel wells there. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, you know, being a little bit unstable, but you guys definitely let me know in the comments below what you think, uh, you know, could be the fix for that. I am always, uh, I'm always uh, happy to uh, get some feedback from you guys, but I guess without further ado, let's go on one last little flight here. Perfect. Thrusters on. And we're slowly gonna take off here. Awesome. Awesome. Beautiful. Oh, a little bit unstable, but that's okay because we can control it. Oh, I love it. I do love it, guys. I do really love it. It's uh, it's a fun little, fun little truck now. I guess flying truck. <laughs> it takes a lot of focus to fly it, but that's okay. I may put a thruster on the back. Uh, you guys let me know. I'm going to do another episode very shortly here. So let me know what you think the fix could be or how I could improve this. Uh, I would really appreciate it because clearly I am incapable myself. <laughs> but in any case, guys, if you did enjoy this video, definitely let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Uh, if you did like the video, click the like button. It helps the video be seen by other people. The algorithm does its magic. And if you guys aren't subscribed yet, subscribe so that you can stay up to date with all the future videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. I'm just going to keep flying around because this is so much fun. <laughs> it's actually pretty controllable, guys. Now that I know sort of like the ins and outs of flying this thing, 
it's actually fairly controllable and I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, I do think that there's always room for improvement though, so like I said, give me your tips in the comments below. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, tip, 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 you can make it, you can make it, you can make it little one, yes! Oh jeez. I wonder what first person is like. Just absolutely terrifying. <laughs> first person looks cool actually.